T. Allen Boy, don't forget to subscribe. Yes, sir. Back here at Costco, I'm gonna buy uh, a toilet. It's about that time to switch it out. So I got the uh, Water Ridge, which is one fifty nine ninety nine, and one ninety nine. I'm just gonna go with this one right here. It's your boy D and I am back with another video. Cheers, y'all. Just made some fresh brewed coffee just to start off my morning. Oh my God. Just straight black, no sugar, no nothing. Sometimes you just gotta take it straight. So, so I'm here with my beautiful family, my lady, Aquaman, Queen in general, cat. I gotta have some uh, blue agave with the oatmeal light chiselation. Still got a few projects to complete. Uh, still got my lady's uh, office to complete. Uh, I'm gonna show you guys, it's still under construction right now. Uh, so about two or three weeks, and I'll go ahead and show you guys the office. Um, we was gonna switch it to an office slash guest room, but we're just doing the whole room and office space for her and for the kids to you know, play their games. So it's gonna be like a gaming room slash office. Continue to work hard, continue to provide for the family and stay prayed up. Um, without the man upstairs, we are nothing. After this good meal, then I'm gonna go ahead and start with the, uh, the bathroom, replace the toilet pole with the new one that I just purchased from Costco. And then we go from there, y'all. But uh, yeah, the first step is, hold on, let me just wind that back. To be honest, I do not know why I'm showing you guys on how to change a toilet bowl, man. But thank you guys for tuning in, easy work. And uh, yeah, everything I do around my house, I do it myself. And if I'm not able to, then that's when I hire a contractor to come and do uh, the works. And the best tool is YouTube. And that's what I've learned from over the years. You know what I mean? The best teacher, Google and YouTube. We got to use those tools to the best of our abilities y'all i'm telling you you ain't gotta rely on anybody else to come and do your work you can do it for me i did everything around my house we did the front yard we uh extended our driveway to concrete and guess what i learned it from you too just to hope the reborn laying out the uh the concrete shout out to Uggs for coming through to help out and the fence around the house me and my brothers we built it the backyard we built the deck, DIY, do it yourself. Everything that I've learned myself is from YouTube. And uh, that, it's such a great tool, man, to learn whatever you wanna learn. YouTube is the place to go nowadays. I just Google it, research it myself, and I do it. Go ahead and get this work started with, this is the before. So check it out, y'all. I'm gonna give you guys a quick review of the flushing. Mechanism is on the top. It's not on the on the side. This is the, uh, the new toilet that I just installed. And the cool thing about this toilet, so this can actually come off, y'all. See, this part can come off, and then you can just clean around the pole. Once you're done, you can just attach this back on. So that's the cool thing about this toilet. Time to take it dumb. Let's go. I'm gonna be making some carne asada nachos, y'all. Horrible transition from toilet to making food, but it is what it is, so. Now we just tend to cook food at home. My lady's at work right now. Um, I'm gonna be cooking some uh, some carne asada nachos. We just have a habit of eating out, cause you know, we're just busy with work, grab a quick bite, 
which we lose a lot of money. So, so more cooking in and less eating out. For the past couple months, that's what we've been doing, just eating more at home. And it's a struggle though, right? you know, with time, with just being busy throughout the day. And sometimes it's just, you know, hard to uh, find time to cook. So we just tend to eat out often. It's the time for a change, just changing the way we uh, live, changing the way we think, changing the way we do things. And uh, one, one good thing about it is just sitting around the table making memories and the kids are able to just enjoy uh, each other's company and to be able to just conversate. That's a better way to enjoy good food around the table. And uh, we're just trying to bring that back. You know, uh, me and my lady, we've been doing a lot of adjustments um, to the way we live and how we live, you feel me? But yeah, let's go ahead and get into this cook session. Thank you guys for tuning in, man. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and get started with the cooking. It's about that time to cook. So yeah, I got the green onions, cilantro, some sour cream, salsa, some jalapenos, uh, queso cheese, chips, uh, habanero, and a uh, carne asada, street taco seasoning. nachos homemade um, I prefer like everything on it but uh since the girls they like certain stuff on it I kept it simple so I just add all the dressing on to my side like the hot uh, salsa onions habanero I put it on my side and then the rest kept it simple on their end you feel me yeah yummy would you give it 10 out of 10? I'm glad you're enjoying the nachos.